in the land of Old Manila, a child who was born. You will grow soft and delicate like a lily, and pearls you shall admire, pearls you shall love. Someday, when you grow up, you will own priceless pearls taken from the blue seas of far away Mindanao. From the time Sinagtala was born, the talisay and tamagong trees had blossomed and fructified 16 times. As time passed, 16 flower seasons had passed and the first part of the prophecy came true. She was called the... Lady by the river! You look so beautiful as always! But I am not beautiful! One must have strings of lustrous pearls. But I only have this little one. two baskets for me that is so strong and beautiful. I will give it to the mother of Walangkula, the son of Chi, he who rules the Pagisan Barangay. You don't need to rush into making. Make the best you can. Now go. Yes, madam. Girl with a slender body. Do you wish to fall into the river? Ah, Magiting, the fisherman of the deep and a warrior of the Pagisan clan. Do you need those bambans? I need them. Lilies together, near flowers to adore your hair. Let me help you. All right. Love was filled in that moment, and the destined were finally together. They constantly met with each other, but what you don't know is that a spy is lurking by the shadows, witnessing every moment. I must tell Madame Lacambini that her beloved Walang Gulat is using the salad of basket river.
No, she won't. There was evil in the air. The sky was overcast and clouds were beginning to gather. The city of Maynilad was not happy that day, for the drums were beating weirdly, announcing that an ordeal would soon take place. Announcement! People of this barangay, Nagambini's pearl, the priceless heirloom, passed from mothers to generations, have been missing. Many days have passed, but it has not been found. Nakambini therefore charges Sinagtala, the daughter of Pirangkawayan, for the theft of the jewels. The lost Maginero pearls were left on the bronze casket and the box was on the Kamagong tables of Lakabini's room the day Sinagtala came and delivered the baskets. Sinagtala, swear that you didn't stole the jewels. If I did take the jewels of Lakambini, they made the hungry crocodile swallow me and the flames scorched me. Alipin, so you say you didn't see all these people, nor you take the priceless heirloom. No! No pearls did I take, but that day, I saw the basket weaver staring covetously at the jewel on the Kamagong table. Was the Raha's daughter in the room when the basket weaver came? No, she was not there. That's why I left the room to search for Lakambini. But she was not around. When I came back to the room, the basket weaver was already leaving. And she said, Lakambini doesn't want me anymore. As these proofs thrown against Sinagtala are legitimate, we, the judges, charge Sinagtala as guilty for stealing the pearls. Guards, arrest her! No! no you can't arrest her daughter! Get her daughter! Her daughter. <laughs> no! No! Get her daughter. No! 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 What a disgrace! Sinagtala, do you wish to have a reply to all the accusations? No. No, I didn't. If the pearls can still be found, nothing more will be said. But if they are not, look! The son of the chief of the Pagitan! Greetings, dear Elder. Ah. I come with me. With the plea that Sinagtala must be spared the trial. Two, I have with me the indemnity of the lost pearls, other costly gems from my father, the Pagisan chief. That Sinagtala must be spared the shame of the ordeal. Wisely, we thank the Raha of Pagisan and his son. But by the laws and customs of ancient Minilad, a theft done to a family of Ra is irreparable. The trial must therefore go on. Magiti, we will continue the trial. So, Magiti is walang gulat whom Lakambini wanted to wed. The jewels are not yet found, and all the accused people have sworn they are innocent. The blood of our ancestors, the most noblest of them all, blood that was cursed through my veins, and yet you've disgraced me? No. <laughs> it is ordained that Sinagtala will be the first one to pass the ordeal. Therefore, must the accused Sinagtala, as the order who will follow, dip her hands to the boiling pot and take out the white stone that rests in its bottom. And if her hands remain unblistered, unburned, 
then it is a sign that our gods find her guiltless and we pronounce her innocent. But if they are burnt, Oh, 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 oh,